Hello, my people. Welcome to the SCORE channel and welcome to Nova Southeastern University. I'm on the last leg of my awesome trip through the United States and I stopped for a few days in Miami. As usual, I sat down with the International Missions Counselor, Mirela Batista, to talk to her a little bit more about NSU, find out what makes it so great for international students. Will you be an NSU shark? Let's find out. My name is Mirela Batista. I'm originally from Brazil. I work in here at NSU for about two years as an International Admissions Counselor. We have more than 50 different undergraduate programs in all different areas of study, but but marine biology, environmental science are two most popular programs that we have. Business program is very popular. And as you started out originally as only a graduate school, that means that all of the undergraduate programs have really been designed to help you pursue a master's or a PhD. That makes it a really great option if you're looking to study something like medicine, where you need to do a pre-med course like biology, which is coincidentally one of the most popular undergraduate options here at NSU. In fact, they have over 30 dual admission programs where if you get into the undergraduate program, you'll also get a spot in their master's programs if you decide to continue your education. And then we also have a lot of opportunities for students who want to go into the medical and dental program. Law school has a very good law program and then a lot of the students want to come here and do like a criminal justice bachelor's degree and then go into the law program. All of the facilities here are extremely modern. I've been walking around this campus, taking a look at all these buildings, going inside and everything looks new. So we are actually known as one of 59 university with high research activity and community engagement. So this is part of actually what we call experiential learning. So students get a more hands-on opportunity. Usually they have to do six units of what we call Excel, so experiential learning. I mean internship, study abroad, and the other one is a research. So what kind of student does NSU look for? So we don't really have an ideal candidate. What we are looking for is for that student who wants to make a difference. We big on innovation so if you are someone who thinks uh, out of the box and wanted to do great things in life and want to engage in the community we have lots of students who come from all over the world and they want to be doctors and then we ask them okay so how do you want to be a different doctor like how do you want to make a difference if you are someone who wants to help the community help the world be a better place then you're definitely a good fit for NSU because we are going to support you throughout your years of studies. That's something that really stood out to me was the focus on community engagement engagement and also just on research in general. NSU really does look to change the world and they want students who want to do the same thing. If you're a big dreamer, maybe you can make your dreams come true here. Now, when it comes to cost, this is a private university, so you don't have to think about in-state or out-of-state tuition. Although there are benefits for Florida residents. Florida gives grants to every resident, even if they're going to private universities. So if you do have a parent living in Florida, you might be able to cut your costs significantly. Even if you don't, you can still apply for any of the scholarships that NSU offers. Several different opportunities for uh, international students to apply to scholarships. The Dean's Award is an automatic scholarship. They receive between five and $19,000 a year. And then there's the Razor's Edge Scholars Program. Now this is a four-year program that requires you to live on campus. That's a plane going by. In Florida, you're near an airport, man. So the Razor's Edge program is one of the most popular scholarships, five different tracks for different interests. And it comes with a $24,000 scholarship. There's other scholarships too for people who are looking to study business. There's even one that gives you money towards a startup idea if you want to launch a business coming out and of college. And then we also have the Presidential Scholar that's like a full tuition, but it's by invitation only. So students who qualify for that scholarship, they are going to be notified upon admission and then they will be required to interview. With all the clubs that are here, all the community activities and all the great sports facilities, you're gonna have a good time. You're gonna meet a lot of people. And on a very diverse campus like this, you're gonna feel right at home. We are a very diverse campus. We have students from more than 50 different states and more than 110 countries. So you are going to be able to make friends from all over the world. We have more than 120 clubs and organizations. We even have a festival that we call Sharkapalooza. Students from all the clubs, they showcase what they've been doing and they trying to get new members. Our campus is pretty safe. We are located in Fort Lauderdale. We do have a public safety department that is available 24 seven. 
seven, students can just press a button if they need help. As someone who comes from a very cold place and now lives in a very warm place, weather is just sort of whatever to me, but Mirella made a really good point when she talked about the weather in South Florida. In South Florida, it's warm all year long. We are located 20 minutes from the beach in Fort Lauderdale, 45 minutes from Miami. It's a perfect place for students who are coming from South America to feel more home because I know the transition is not easy. You're gonna be away from home, away from family. You want to have at least a place that's warm, welcoming, you know, and friendly. So NSU is all of that. The application portal for fall 2022 is open now. Uh, early decision and early action deadline is November 1st and regular decision is February 1st. You don't need to take the SAT. All we require from you is official high school transcript translated to English by a certified translator. We also require the English proficiency test. It can be the TOEFL, the IELTS, the Duolingo. If you went to IB school, then we can definitely uh, waive that. Just get in contact with me. And this is further proof that if you dig a little bit deeper, you can find some really great universities for you. Thanks again to NSU and thanks again to Mirella for taking the time to talk to me about NSU to share a little more of Nova Southeastern with us today. Planes. If you want to check out some of the other videos that I've done on this amazing U.S. tour, then check out the university episode from the University of Pittsburgh or take a look at the first one that came out from this trip from Hillsdale College. I'll see you next week.